Gareth, I don't think anyone's gonna call about Sprinkles. So, someone has to. I put a post in it. everything. A purple cat isn't that hard to miss. Garth, if someone found a purple cat with actual purple hair, then it's incredibly possible they'd keep it. Or try to hand it over to a science facility to study for money. No! I have to believe Sprinkles is okay! Garth, just be ready for either no news or bad news. Sprinkles wasn't even your cat. She might have had an owner. Yeah, I know. It's just Sprinkle. What are you up to, Dante? Oh, uh, me? Oh, nothing. Just going to, um, head to my room and turn in for the night. It's 3 p.m. Yeah, I'm just, uh, not feeling too well today. Got a bad cold from the snow coming in my room from the broken window and everything. <coughs> so, I'll be turning in for the night. Night, guys! We got his window fixed this morning, and he slept on the couch until it was fixed. Lawrence! He had the mail in his hand. Dante! My door! Gareth, I swear you're dead ma- What's this? Hey, that letter is for me! It's addressed to all of us. It's from half now. Dear Dante, Lawrence, and Gareth, You are invited to a party Caitlin, Koi-chan, and I are hosting at our place. It's a special party that is kind of like more of a housewarming party, but since it's in season, we're doubling it as a pre-holiday party too. No gifts are required to come. Feel free to bring a plus one. Aphmau. You sneak! You were going to keep this from us! No! I just wanted to read it first to find out what it was about. It could have been a love letter to me from her. Dream on! Speaking of love, tonight might be the night I get that kiss from her. What? It's a holiday-themed party. There's bound to be mistletoe there. That's right, I totally forgot about the mistletoe. This is perfect! This is my chance! <laughs> what are you chuckling at? Remember what I said a few days ago about keeping your cool? You guys are destined to blow it. I'm just going to sit on the sidelines, watch the whole thing go downhill, and swoop in when the time is right. Now, if you'll excuse me, I need to take a shower to get ready for the party. Garth, he's right. We can't let him win. Right. We're still rivals, but we can't let Dante get anywhere near that mistletoe either. Right. Now I'm going to my room to plan. Same! Uh, hey, you wanna flush all the toilets in the house while he's in the shower? <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Deck the halls with boughs of holly, fa la 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 ha 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 cold! <laughs> Lauren! Gareth, that's it! Wait, did you guys steal my towel? I hate you both! Oh, okay, uh, Caitlin, can you at least help us prepare for this party? Oh, oh my gosh! This is your party, Aphmau, not mine. Caitlin, come on, don't be like that. Look, Kawaii-chan is getting into the holiday spirit. Yeah, and, and helping make desserts for the party, okay? Look, she's putting flour in the, um, okay. That's Kawaii-chan on a regular basis. That doesn't count. Uh, in any case, she's being much more helpful than you are right now. Caitlin, ugh, we're gonna salt and pepper this chicken. I didn't even want to do this party. Uh, well, <sighs> Caitlin, what about Christmas decorating? You were like incredibly hyped to do that the other day. Come on, I mean, that's Christmas decorating. That's easy. Uh, what? No, it wasn't. N like, not at all, actually, it wasn't easy. With a party, I have to host people and smell good. Hmm. Oh, oh, well, I guess you're right there. Smelling good was never really your forte. <laughs> Why, you little... That's not what I meant! Come here! <laughs> Where'd you go? Oh, no! <laughs> okay, all right, calm down. It's not my fault. You really set yourself up for that. Ladies, ladies, calm down. Uh... <laughs> she started it. 
<laughs> okay, look. Wait, Kawai Chan, your face is just beaming. Like, Kawai Chan is just so excited about the party. Uh, um, oh no, let me guess. Wait, what? Uh, I don't think that she. Where'd she go? Mi Senpai is going to be here! Uh, he's just a dumb guy. Uh, uh, oh. <laughs> um. Mi Senpai is not dumb! He's smart, intelligent, and graceful! Uh. <laughs> Kawai Chen, my gosh. Then why does he have a job as a pizza delivery guy? <laughs> oh, Caitlin. Come on. Kawai Chen doesn't know. Maybe Mi Senpai is saving money for college! Also, pizza delivery requires gracefulness. <laughs> oh, Kawai-chan. You keep making this guy out to be something he's not. Uh, mm, uh, Caitlin, you need to really chill out with that. Come on. How does Caitlin Sama know he's not what Kawai-chan thinks he is? Uh, uh. <laughs> Have you even talked to him? Uh, uh, Kawai? Uh, no. Mm. Kawai-chan, I'm sorry. You're just crazy. Like, a lot crazy. Uh, Caitlin, come on. What? I'm allowed to say it. Aren't you tired of it too? You of all people should be. Uh, if I was tired of it, I would have said something about it long ago. Yes, it is annoying sometimes, but that's who Kawai-chan is. If I didn't like who she was, then I wouldn't have even moved in with her in the first place. So, <clears throat> what about now that you know she has a shrine down in the basement? Uh, I mean, I wish I didn't know about it, but I'm okay with it. As long as it remains fictional and doesn't become real because someone tried to interfere with people's lives. Okay? Oh! Kawai-chan never had plans like that. <laughs> um, I don't like the way you're laughing. That's a lie. I'm out. Uh, Caitlin, you. Okay, Mrs. Grinch. Well, at least come down once to greet everyone. <laughs> nope. <sighs> what crawled up her stocking and died? Seriously. Caitlin Sama is mad at Kawai Chan because, while Caitlin Sama was putting away the decorations, Kawai Chan went into her room and put away her laundry and found something she shouldn't have. Uh, oh, I. Uh, was it the poster in the closet? So, Afmal Senpai knows about it too? Huh, <sighs> that's a relief. Caitlin Sama said she'd do bad things to Kawai Chan if she told anyone else. Do you really think she's holding the poster for a friend? Uh, <laughs> do I believe it? Not at all, Kawai-chan. <laughs> Didn't think so. Kawai-chan understands Caitlin sama isn't really into girly stuff and tries to respect that, but she's really sensitive about it. Kawai-chan wishes Caitlin sama was more comfortable talking about her feelings, but she needs some time, Kawai-chan supposes. Uh, yeah. You're right. I mean, she should never be embarrassed about the things she likes. Even if others judge her, she should just always be proud. Exactly! Now, um, one other thing. Kawai-chan didn't think her shrine really had upset Afmao senpai Does it really bother Afmao senpai Uh, uh, uh... A little. I mean, Kawai-chan, I don't mind that you're into that kind of fandom stuff at all. I really don't. Because, let's face it, I do it sometimes too. But, Eren is a real person, and so am I. And it's just a little weird to me with real people. I mean, it would be different if you shipped me with a fictional character, but well, yeah. Again, I, I don't mind that you do that, but the creepy part is, is that I know there's a shrine of it um, in the house I live in, and that's kind of the thing... Kawai-chan, that's the kind of thing that you use Tumblr for, okay? Ah! Kawai-chan gets it. Afma senpai after this party, Kawai-chan promises to take down the shrine and will make a New Year's resolution to keep that stuff to herself. Mm-hmm. 
<laughs> Thanks. I really appreciate the effort, Kawaii Chan. Again, you don't have to stop it completely, just not with a real person. And no problem. Now, are we going to finish up the food placement or what? <laughs> right, let's get started. We, oh, how, much, how much time do we have? We have like, like tw 20 minutes until the guests arrive. Oh, come on, Chan. Kawaii Chan, we really gotta get to work. Oh, I gotta salt and pepper these things. Ugh. I'll get it, I'll get it. Thanks, girls, for your help. <sighs> oh, hi, Reese. Thank you for inviting me. You really didn't have to, you know. We barely know each other. <laughs> Duh, that's why I invited you, so we can all get to know each other. I suppose that makes sense. <laughs> I mean, I just find it odd, because all I do is deliver your pizzas. Ah, but... Enough of that. I know it's so sudden, but behind me are my roommates. My brother, Marsh, and my friend from the swim team, McLeod. Uh, they don't get out as often, so I wanted to invite them over with me. Granted, I don't get out as often either, so I hope it isn't a burden to ask if they can attend. Please don't say yes just because they're right here. I have no problem telling them no. Uh, well, I mean, honestly... It's not a big deal. It's perfectly fine. I mean, the more the merrier, right? Really? Uh, thank you. <laughs> it's no problem. Now you boys come on in and make yourselves comfortable. Come on. There's lots of, like, treats and stuff. Oh, hello. Oi. Thanks, lass. You didn't have to do that, Dar. Uh, <laughs> you... You're... You're welcome. I. By the way, there's this gal named Crystal that might show up here if she knows I'm here. Don't let her in. Trust me, she'd be upset seeing as I dumped her. She's a good gal, though, just crazy. In any case, party up in here! <laughs> what? I have a feeling I just made a terrible mistake that I'm going to regret later. Oh, uh, I'm sorry, hello! <laughs> it's great to meet you! Greetings. It's a pleasure to meet you. My name is Marsh. I am Reese's older brother. I brought some scented candles as a housewarming gift. Uh, what? Aw, you didn't have to. Uh, uh, the invite said... I know what the invite said, but I find it rude to show up to a party uninvited with nothing. So please, accept this gift. Uh, <laughs> sure, yeah, um, thank you so much. You're welcome. Now, shall I take off my shoes? I don't want to get your carpet dirty. Uh, <laughs> no. I mean, you're really polite. Don't worry about it at all. I mean, keep them on. Now come inside and enjoy the party. <laughs> oh my gosh, Caitlin and Kawaii Chan better come downstairs because I've been hosting everybody by myself. <sighs> Ugh, I swear those girls, they're up and- <sighs> Celestia, at least you're here to help me host everyone. <laughs> Good girl. Uh, I'm gonna go see if uh, they're ready to come downstairs. <sighs> Caitlin, Kawaii Chan- Oh, Kawaii Chan. Uh, F. Mel Senpai, Kawaii Chan doesn't think she can do this. Uh, oh, well, that, that's right, Reese is here, I forgot. Kawaii Chan, you got this. You have his present, don't you? I mean, y yes. But maybe Kawaii Chan should should wait until Christmas. Uh, Kawaii Chan, remember our deal? I said, and we agreed on that if I helped you get him a nice present, you would give it to him yourself, and you would talk to him in complete sentences. Remember? Y yes, but looking at him there, uh, uh, Kawaii Chan, uh, you can do this. Uh, I can't do this. Uh, Kawaii Chan? Oh, Kawaii Chan, come on. Uh, oh, a doorbell again? Who could that be? Uh, sorry, folks. I'll, I'll be back to host you one second. <laughs> Who could that be right now? N Nicole! Nicole, come on in. <laughs> come on. <laughs> Afmao, good to see you. <laughs> wow, it's really great to see you, but forgive me. I, I wasn't aware that 
you were coming to the party. Like, at all. Ah, Caitlin invited me. She... She did? Uh, let me guess. She forgot to RSVP me, huh? Yeah, pretty much. She didn't... I mean, if she... she <laughs> we sent you out an invitation, but she never told me. I mean, she's in close contact with you, so... Let's just get to the point. She's really in a funk today. Like... Really? <laughs> uh. Pfft, that chick is oh, that chick always is. Should I go smack her one or two until she comes out of her room? Uh, how do you know that she's in her room? <laughs> uh, because we're like best buds. <laughs> well, then, uh, then then why didn't she suggest you to move in with her when I told her about moving? I'm, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to ask that, but because. Caitlin and I, while we get along well, we clash way too often. Ah, oh, we'd rip each other's heads off. That actually makes a lot of sense. Yeah. <laughs> now, I'll go drag her out of her room. You go and be a good hostess. Leave Caitlin to me. <laughs> Thank you, Nicole. I appreciate this so much. <laughs> oh, greeting everyone is so tiring. Uh, and we're just getting started. I need a drink of water or something. Or for Kawaii and Caitlin to come out of their rooms to help me. <sighs> a drink of water. <sighs> that was refreshing. <sighs> oh my gosh. Oh, hey, Dante. Hey, girl. Do you love water? Uh, yeah. I, I mean, I just drank it. So... That means you love 60% of me. What say we go under the mistletoe for the additional 40%? Uh, oh my Irene. Uh, oh my gosh. Uh, <laughs> McLeod? Too hot for you to handle? Uh, <laughs> Dante. Oh my Irene, this has to be a joke. Wait, are you serious? As serious as you smell like trash? What? What? You... Are you serious, Dante? You don't have to say that out loud. Can I take you out? I. <laughs> oh my. <laughs> oh my gosh, Dante! For a second, I thought you actually said I smelled like trash. You had me there. I thought you were actually hitting on me. You're such a good actor. <laughs> Love doesn't happen overnight. Uh. Okay. <laughs> good. <laughs> Oh, Dante, you're so good at joking. <laughs> uh, what's going on over here? Uh, oh my gosh. Um, it, it, uh, not again. Ugh, this is embarrassing. Reese, Marsh, get up here and dance. Is this the party or not? Uh, <laughs> uh, wait, Michi? Uh, now this is turning into a party. Uh, oh, okay. Uh, <laughs> uh, McLeod, get off that table! Uh, I knew I was going to regret this. Uh, Brendan, hi! How are you enjoying the party? I almost had Michi. <laughs> uh, yeah. N oh my gosh. Either last, come here. <laughs> no, I don't want to even... Uh, Brendan, Michi is just here because Kawaii-chan had to invite her because she got stuck in a situation with her at work. We... Yeah. Anyway, Lawrence, Gareth, hey! Can't we ask Michi to help us with this? She's sneaky. Wait, uh, we could just call her over there, but Dante is watching. Uh, okay. Um, fine. <laughs> uh, Celestia is doing good. Yep, and, uh, wait, what? <gasps> Someone's in the basement! Oh no, oh no, okay, alright. No, 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 uh, um, Wait, it's just Nicole and Caitlin. Uh... <laughs> this is hilarious! Afma, you must be really creeped out. <sighs> Aren't you glad you didn't move in with Kawaii-chan when she asked you a few months ago? <laughs> Nicole! See, I told you I could get her out of her room. <laughs> Can you close the door to her room and lock it from the inside? She left it open when she was so excited to show me this. I want to lock her out of her room. <laughs> Yeah, I can do that. Mm, yeah, sure. Fine. Whatever. <laughs> She's gonna get mad at you, not me. <laughs> Nicole, you're going to get me in so much trouble if she finds out it's me. <sighs> Alright, going upstairs. 
<sighs> I guess this is the way that's gonna really help me get her to host. I <gasps> what are you guys doing here? <gasps> what are you doing to post her? Oh my god! Oh my god! It's perfect. Glad I bought stickers of Zane's head. Forget the reindeer butt prank. This one is better. <laughs> Oh my god, you guys are just so... <laughs> what did you do to her poster? She's gonna kill you guys! And by extension, she'll kill me! Lawrence did it! It's just a prank, bro. Uh, it's, it's, we need to fix this. We need to fix this before she sees it. I just... <laughs> well, if you follow me, I can show you how we can fix this. Uh, uh, really? I mean, Lawrence, if you're serious, you're a lifesaver. Really, Lawrence? Hey, wait a minute! Uh, oh, just... Please! I... Apmau, follow me! I know what to do! <laughs> I swear, if you guys trick me, I'll be so mad! You better fix this! Ah! Where are we going? Kawaii-chan, what is your problem? Kawaii-chan knows exactly what you boys are up to. And if you ruin Kawaii-chan's ship, then you'll be... Hold it right there. Yeah? You dare interrupt Lawrence from kissing his one true love? Excuse me? It's obvious Lawrence should be under that mistletoe. Hey, back off. Finally, someone with some sanity. Now, you ladies are acting like absolute immature brats. Thank you. It's Gareth who should be under that mistletoe with Ath Mao. What, Nicole? Shut up, Caitlin. I just want to fight because I'm bored. Gareth and Ath Mao make the cutest couple. He can't even talk to her. But when he does, it's cute. You're both wrong. Aaron and Ath Mao are so OTP. You girls want to go? Huh. Bring it! I've been waiting for this! <laughs> oh, you. You're such a sloppy kisser. What?! what? <laughs> Calm down, Celestia. It's just one kiss. Yes, I know I have some chicken on my face, but... You can eat people food, you super adorable little dog. Okay, you can eat all people food you want. I know you so much. dog. Aww. Now that's an adorable ship. It's beautiful. Okay, it's cute. The dog. <laughs> of course. Wait, where are you going? No, Celestia, I can change, please! <clears throat> Hello there, handsome. 